Hi, this video we'll be looking at duplicating a drawing. So at this point we want to get the fingers to look like they're wrapping in front of you know, or over the control lever. And we're going to do that by duplicating this hand element right here. Now the reason we have to duplicate and not just copy paste is that copying and pasting a drawing element will create a clone of that drawing. And a clone drawing element retains a link to the original drawing. So if you erase or modify something in a drawing element, all those changes will be reflected in its clones and vice versa. If you duplicate a drawing, you can make changes to a duplicate drawing independent of the original. So let's select our hand and duplicate by going to Edit, Duplicate. There we go. You may have noticed this in the Drawing tab if you go to Drawing. There is duplicate drawings. This is for duplicating specific drawings inside a drawing element. For duplicating the entirety of a drawing element, you'd use a duplicate function in the edit tab like I just showed you. And let's connect it to the hand peg, like so. Click and drag from the bottom of the hand peg to the duplicate. Now the reason we're connecting it to the hand and not anywhere else is because this peg controls the uh, the movement for the hand itself. This, remember from the last video, is uh, the control for the entirety of the hand and the control lever. So if you, for example, just want to move the hand, reposition it, or animate the hand itself independently of everything, you do all your keyframes here in the hand peg bar, not the master peg bar. 